Welcome Trader! In this video, we'll cover Stop Loss and Take Profit Orders. When it comes to trading, solid money management is one of the keys to achieving profits on financial markets over the long term. Trading strategies generally include ways to limit risk. That's why stop losses and take profit levels are an integral part of your trading. The first and easiest way to add a stop loss or take profit to your trade is by doing it right away when placing new orders. First, choose the market which you want to trade in. Next, click the Order Ticket button or double-click on the name of the market. And check the options for Stop Loss and Take Profit Levels. Now you can enter a particular price level for Stop Loss or Take Profit fields. Please remember that a Stop Loss will be executed automatically when the market moves against your position and a Take Profit level will be executed automatically when the price reaches your specified price level. The principles of these orders are simple. If you want to take a long or buy position, you're allowed to set a Stop Loss level below the current market price and a Take Profit level above current market price. If you want to go short or sell, then the Stop Loss must be placed above the entry price and the take profit should be below the opening price of your trade. You can adjust one or both of these before you open the trade. You can also add or edit these levels once your position is opened. If you have an open position you'd like to add a stop loss or take profit to, you can simply use trade lines on the chart. Let's have a look at the chart. You can see there are stop loss and take profit lines which you can quickly and easily modify. Press and hold the left button on the trade level and slide to assume price level. This is a useful way to visually set your stop loss and take profit according to your technical analysis. There are two more ways of adding stop loss and take profit levels through the terminal module. Firstly, to add or modify stop loss or take profit levels, simply double click on your opened or pending order and a new window with trade details will open. The order modification window will appear and now you're able to enter or modify the stop loss or take profit by the exact market level or by defining a points range from the current market price. The second way is even faster. All you need to do is to specify the levels right from the terminal. You just click on the plus button in either stop loss or take profit column and you enter your levels. As you can see, it's really simple and comes in handy when you need to make quick trading decisions. Now that you know how to place stop loss and take profit levels, let's explore another very useful feature known as the trailing stop. Let's say you've opened a long position and the market moves in the right direction, making your trade a profitable one. Your original stop loss, which was placed at a level below your open price, can now be moved to your open price, so you can break even, or above the open price, so you're guaranteed a profit. To make this process automatic, you can use a trailing stop. This means that if your trade is currently running a profit and you want to protect part of that profit from reversals in the market, the trailing stop can automatically follow the price according to your settings. Following the example above, please bear in mind, however, that your trade needs to be running a profit large enough for the trailing stop to move above your open price before your profit can be guaranteed. To set a trailing stop, right-click the open position in the terminal window and specify your desired pip value of distance between the take profit level and the current price in the trailing stop menu. Click Modify to confirm your order 
and the trailing stop becomes active. As soon as the position turns profitable, your trailing stop will follow the price automatically, maintaining the previously established distance. Your trailing stop can be deactivated by deselecting the trailing stop box in the Trade Modification module. As you can see, XStation 5 provides you with plenty of ways to protect your positions, giving you useful risk management tools for rapid price changes or when you're unable to manually monitor your positions. Thank you for watching. See you for the next lesson.